Hello, I'm Stuart Stevenson and I'm the convener of the Standards, Procedures and Public Appointments Committee of the Scottish Parliament. And we're just starting a bit of work that's looking at the role of conveners of our committees. So what do our committees actually do? They hold the government to account, they look at legislation that's being proposed to Parliament, and most importantly of all, perhaps, we take the views of the people beyond Parliament into account in all the work that we do. So what do conveners actually do? They're like chair of any meeting, they hold the meeting to order, they decide the order of business, but more fundamentally, they are elected by the committees. And that's an important question. Should we appoint conveners in that way? Should we have a different approach? We already make sure that the balance of committee conveners reflects the political balance of Parliament, so committees don't have a big choice. They've got to choose from a particular political party. But that's enough of that. Let's actually have a look at some of the conveners in action. We're joined by Connor, by Laura, Charlene, Peter and Lana. We've invited you here today to share your experiences of the Scottish Welfare Fund and the committee will ask you a range of questions. We are keen to hear about what you think worked well and anything that you think could have been improved. I would remind members, uh, if they would, to keep their uh, questions uh, as short and to the point uh, as possible. And similarly, uh, answers that are as uh, short and to the point would, would be helpful in getting through the uh, subjects in the time available. Can I welcome the opportunity to speak in this debate on behalf of the Justice Committee, the League Committee, in consideration of the Bill. I emphasise I'm speaking as convener, not as an SNP backbencher. No doubt some folks will be pleased to hear that. So the convener's role is clearly an important one. You've seen them in action, seen what they do. But how accountable are conveners to Parliament and indeed to the public beyond Parliament? Should we perhaps be electing them from the whole parliament uh, to give greater authority and greater credibility to their role? Should we make sure that they continue to represent the different political balances in the parliament? It's time for you to give us your views on how we should appoint our conveners. We want to hear from you. We're on Twitter, we're on Facebook, and of course, we're on this video. So let us know.